Okay, here's a, a tree I'm just about to do a bit of summer pruning on it. Uh, just a few typical cuts, not going to show the whole operation. This is a branch, for example, this little bit that's growing right across, right into the middle. I'm just going to take that out completely. And here's another one, it's a bit too, uh, a bit too much growth there. I'm just cutting these new, new growths, this is 2009 wood. I'm just cutting those back to short bits, okay, about uh, just above the basal, five leaves, to cut back, back to about five leaves, okay. Those should, those should hopefully produce fruit spurs. And here, here's some, a bit of overcrowding. I'm going to cut that out. Here, the tree's growing taller than I want it to. Okay, you can see that's as high as I can reach. That's the maximum reach. I'm six foot tall, that's the maximum I can reach. It's a bit high. Um, here's where the wood was pruned to last year. There's the 2008 wood. There's a join with the 2009 wood. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to concentrate on this, you can see this carefully. I'm just making a cut directly above a fruit bud. Alright, you can see I've um, cut back the wood, I've allowed more light down into the tree, um, but I haven't removed a single fruit bud. I'm going to make a similar cut just here. Okay, you can see what I've done. There's a, another branch near. I'm going to make, do a similar operation. Now you see that's, um, this is quite high up, this is about 8 feet high and I'm just taking a cut into last year's 2008 wood. I've cut off about 2 inches of the 2008 wood, I've cut off a load of 2009 wood I don't need and this is now about 7 feet high, I've just cut that back to a, a fruit um, bud. Alright, you see roughly what I'm doing and here in the centre of the tree I tend to go down, this is at about, um, how high is this? This is about two feet above ground level. I tend to um, remove a lot of wood that's in the centre of the tree. It just allows some um, better circulation of air. Sometimes you may need to remove uh, bits which have got apples on them. Don't have a big crisis of conscience about it. Most of these trees, if they're in good shape, uh, you'll have to remove some apples anyway because the tree will attempt to set more than you've got room for. Okay, just another cut, very similar. See what I'm doing? I'm making cuts into the previous year's wood uh, you see it's two inches of previous year's wood, a load of um, new growth, active, excessive new growth going to the middle of the tree. I'm just making a cut there uh, behind a fruit bud. So I haven't taken any fruit buds out. I've just taken excessive growth of the current year. Again, this is about seven feet above ground level. Just one more cut of that sort. And you get the picture. I'm just taking out wood where there's more wood than we need. Oh, she's got an apple there, but it's a bad apple anyway. It's been damaged by a nasty bug. Okay, so just uh, a couple of little videos, basically the essence of summer pruning. You won't need to summer prune every tree, uh, but it's a very useful thing. There's a guy called Louis Lorette, L-O-R-E-T-T-E, -T -T -E, a Frenchman who uh, really work these techniques out. It looks a bit crazy to be going through your trees and cutting out healthy leaves, uh, but Louis Lorette did the research, he wrote this up and his technique, although it's not practiced in a pure form very much, his technique informs a lot of pruning that goes on commercially uh, worldwide and um, it does keep the tree in better uh, shape um, if you do it right, if you need to do it at all. Uh, so you don't need to worry too much about this, but this is a couple of videos for people who find that their tree is putting on a huge amount of vegetative growth. And if your tree is growing bigger than you've got space to allow it to grow, and you want to reduce, the, you want to restrict the size of your tree, this is the way to do it. Cut back uh, the current year's growth, cut back a little bit, do it in the midsummer, cut it back a little bit into last year's growth, leave the fruit buds. Okay.